And speaking of America's relationship with the UK, British Prime Minister Theresa May has released the most contentious document detailing the Brexit plan at a special cabinet summit at Chequers. In the Brexit blueprint, Britain has published its proposals for future trade with the European Union after it leaves the bloc next March. The newly appointed Brexit Minister Dominique Raab has confirmed that the United Kingdom would leave the single market and the customs union. He also said that the white paper proposes a new UK-EU free trade area for goods. Mr. Speaker, today we published the government's white paper on the UK's future relationship with the EU. It is a new and detailed proposal for a principled, pragmatic and ambitious future partnership between the UK and the EU in line with the policy agreed at Chequers last week. I have now placed a copy of the White Paper in the libraries of both houses. But let me briefly set out the key proposals. Mr Speaker, the Government is determined to build a new relationship that works both for the UK and the EU, one grounded in our shared history but which also looks to a bright and ambitious future, a relationship that delivers real and lasting benefits to both sides. First, Mr Speaker, the White Paper confirms the UK will leave the European Union on the 29th of March 2019, forging a new way in the world, outside the single market, outside the customs union. Lawmakers claim that they had not been able to read the white paper beforehand and the Speaker of the House of Commons has said that both lawmakers from the governing Conservative Party and the opposition were unhappy 